Yo, what is going on, man? Welcome back to the Mr. Catlock channel where we do what? Glitches 99% of the time. And the rest of the time, we just make it up as we go. So, guys, sorry, I've been uh, a little late on these. I think, what did I upload that one this morning, I believe? Okay, so I got two more for you now. But, and I've been working with them all day. I had some bad weather in my area. But anyway, guys, I hope y'all doing good. I hope you're having fun with the Omnigo Strike. So, straight out the gate, we're going to skip to this second section of glitch discussion and things that I'm going to show you. Okay, over there, what we have is I'm showing you that we have three edges uh, of the perimeter of Skywatch, right? We have that edge, then we have this one over here, and then we have the one where you come to my right when you come in from dock 13 each of them have their own unique qualities like this if you're careful enough you can come down here now because you're so low all this really serves for is just a cool place to hang out because if you try to jump back under the map and around you'll see that there's really nowhere to go you could climb the inside of that wall which is what I did before on the other side but it's I mean it would be just for fun I mean if that's something what I'm trying to say is these areas here that were found by me and by Kasperity over here and other places you know over the years are all dedicated basically to trying to get into the Omnigo strike that's what all that's about and actually there's one on this roof up here I need to do with my hunter I don't think anybody's ever seen it not very many people even know about it I don't think I've never uploaded it because it's almost pointless, or it was at the time. And now look, this is perfect. Look, I'm getting height, I'm getting height, and then my stupid controller, bro, or the Twilight Garrison. Every time, man, I'm about to go scuff controller, bro. I'm about to get scuff. Man, this controller is killing me, bro. Every time I get some stuff going, bro, either my, my Twilight gives out or my sword swing gives out. It's one of the buttons. Okay, man, that brings back some memories over there, man. That little corner right there, that was the first time. I think that was the first glitch that me and Casperity ever did together right there, man. That little corner right here. I'm, I'm not mistaken, it was, man. <laughs> it brings back some memories. I miss it. No, I'm just kidding. What's up, Casperity? <laughs> yeah, right here, man. Uh... So he would, yeah, he would, or he him and uh, whoever else was over here, they would jump on their sparrow. And uh, but I, I'm still not, I'm not gonna do all that right here for, just to show you this. But you could technically fly all the way over there if I wasn't losing height because of the, my crappy controller and the lag and the buttons. You could actually make it over there. You'll see, like right there, you see the little hill. If I hadn't lost that little bit of fucking God, God, man. Damn, I can't wait. I, I can't wait to get a scuff controller, bro. It's going to be so much better. Of course, Destiny 2, we may not even have Titans in stores. We might be doing something totally different. I hope y'all not getting too used to Sparrows and all that because it's going to be a whole other game, I bet. All right, so anyway, now I said all that to show you this because this was a little Sparrow spot, man, that I found last time, I think, Omnigo. Man, why do they take so long in between Omnigo strikes, bro? What is the deal with the Nightfall with that? It's like a once every year, man. <laughs> but hey, you know what? I get pumped up when it comes around, bro, because it ain't, it's never here. So I had done this little sparrow glitch right here. Okay, now if you go through this, now you can stand on the inside on the little rocks, and that's what I was talking about on the other side. Like if you were to go to the inside of that uh, cliff side on the other side you could do what I would be you see how right there those little edges you can stand on these but and it was cool then and it's still cool to check it out but it's not that big a deal man that's why at the time I didn't even put no world first and all this man because it's not even that serious but okay but here's one more cool thing I'm gonna show you now on this side okay there's Doc 13 over there if you're coming from this way just so you can get a uh, get your compass in your head here to exactly where I'm going. There's this one uh, Like a little spot right here. It's like a little little ravine that goes down Okay 
and, and all this is just going to get to the omnigo stuff like i said i showed what i showed you yesterday out of the terrestrial complex how to get all the way to skywatch and load it and then from there you we were gonna we're gonna finish that tomorrow what i was doing under the map over there if you don't know the rest of the way then we're gonna do that tomorrow so now this is another cool little thing um, down on these sides when you drop down now don't jump way out and get away from the wall or you'll die so you, you gonna you gotta hug the wall when you do this there you go oh hey who who has uh, never seen what the inside of a bungee tree looks like well you're about to see what it looks like and then you can tell me, is that an acute or a right triangle? <laughs> I don't, I'm joking. Look, see this tree right here? Watch. The inside of this tree is like hollow, man. Look. <laughs> uh It's just like a triangle, man. All the way up. But I guess that's just that type of tree. I mean, I don't know what the other trees look like. But see, that's weird how you can you can just shoot and throw stuff up there. But there's like this little trail that runs around the edge. You can follow this little trail that way and then the other way too. So that's just some cool stuff I wanted to show y'all guys you can experiment with. Alright, the next video I'm going to be uploading is going to be one of my glitches getting out of the Jovian Complex. And then we're going to go back in the Jovian Complex. And we'll even talk about the guy that was the first to ever glitch out of there way back in 2014. 3, 2, 1, Mr. Catlow out.